At 10, the husband of the missing almost park mother hit with two new charges tonight. Investigators say that Brad Simpson begged his business partner to hide his AK-47 rifle in the days following his wife's disappearance. And tonight, both men are facing tampering with evidence charges. Ken's 5 reporter Megan Reyna joins us live in studio. And Megan, you just got your hands on court documents. What else are you learning? Well, EC's earlier today, we learned James Cotter, Brad's business partner, was arrested Monday for tampering with evidence in this missing persons case. Well, according to court documents, that's because he allegedly hid Brad's illegal machine gun behind his bedroom wall and a search dog found it yesterday. 65 year old Cotter was arrested at his home following the discovery. His bail was set to $500,000. Meanwhile, Brad was hit with two new charges just today. He is now facing a tampering with evidence charge and prohibited weapon charge. Records state he texted Cotter on October 8th, two days after his wife went missing. He said, quote, if you're in Bandera, can you meet me at your house? I don't have much time. He went on to text, sorry for the urgency, but you're all I got, especially now. Social media is destroying me. When the Texas Rangers questioned Cotter if he had the gun, he told them he did it. Meanwhile, since October 10th, Brad Simpson has been facing an assault and unlawful restraint charge. He's accused of assaulting his wife, Suzanne Simpson, before she went missing. The ATF also filed a charge against him that day, accusing him of owning an unregistered gun. Today, I reached out to both Brad and Cotter's attorneys, and they both told me they have no comment regarding these charges. And as far as a search for Suzanne, we know they have been focusing on searching wooded areas in and around Almost Park. For a full timeline of her disappearance, go to our website, kins5.com. ECs. Thank you, Megan.